Many of you might remember this made up affluenza term for this thing right here in the picture after he was intoxicated underage behind the wheel of a car and killed four people. Well, he's been released from jail after serving two years. And remember, he escaped and ran to Mexico. Yeah, killed four people because you got money. You know, America, the whore, loves money. As long as you got money, you can do anything to the whore. So he's now released from jail after serving two big old years for killing four people because he had, according to this judge that really should have been thrown head first off the bench, talking about he's got affluenza. You know they paid her. Okay, they paid that judge. They paid her. Affluenza teen is now a free man. Ethan Couch walked out of the Torrent County, Texas jail Monday, days away from turning 21 after serving two years for a parole violation. Now, if you remember when he killed those four people, he didn't even get jail because he had affluenza. I tell you, they must have gave her some serious cash for her to come up with this nonsense. Deputies um, ushered Couch through a tunnel to avoid a media squirm awaiting his release. A reporter with NBC affiliate KXAS said he is currently at a probation office where he'll be issued his court ordered ankle monitor. Oh yeah, that's a real bad punishment for somebody intoxicated and killing four people. Oh, he's got to wear an ankle bracelet. Oh my, oh, a monitor. Oh, the horror. The spoiled rich kid who avoided a significant sentence by blaming his upbringing after a drunken joyride killed four people is reportedly a change person following years of bratty behavior. He ain't change. Now that he's free, he's going to go right back to all his evil ways. I haven't seen arrogance in Ethan in more than nine months. Tim Will uh, Williams, a volunteer chaplain who spent the last two years visiting couch. I don't believe that. I don't believe that. You know, they're going to protect their own and say whatever they have to say to make him seem like he's not so bad anymore. Get out of here, I'm not falling for that. Um, Williams, a childhood friend, Brian Jennings, was one of the four people Couch killed when he drunkenly crashed his red Ford F-350 pickup on the night of June 15th, 2013. The then 16 year old couch had a blood alcohol level triple the legal limit the night of the crash. This is a disgrace. And no, I don't believe he should be free. Now, this is a picture of the vehicle that he crashed and he killed those four people when he was underage and drunk behind the wheel. That damn thing flipped over and everything. You can imagine, just looking at this, can you imagine the speed he was going when this happened? So, affluenza kid is free. This is his mom. If you remember, she ran away with him to Mexico when he escaped and, and ran. As you can see, you know, the whole family's free now. <laughs> the whole family's free and it's going to be like nothing happened and life will go on. And this is nothing but a clear case of white privilege. Period. Very obvious, you know. And the thing is, we get called racist just for pointing out these things, but it's the damn truth. 
Please tell me what you think, ladies and gentlemen. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell. Join me on Black Spot TV and Black uh, Junction TV. And you know damn well, if this was a 16-year-old Black kid that took out four people, it would be a whole different scenario. And we all know this. Peace, family.